for the USF men. They've waited 24 years for this. The third team out of the West Coast Conference, the Dons of San Francisco. The Dons will play seven seed Murray State Thursday in Indianapolis. The Racers are 30 and two and ended the regular season on a 20 game win streak. Yeah, it was definitely nerve wracking. For sure, we was all up there sweating <laughs> and all that stuff, but I wouldn't want it to happen any other way. You dream about it all the time as a kid and you never really know if you're going to get there or not, but now that we're here and our names are up there and the little tournament bracket thing is just something that's a crazy achievement and we're beyond proud of us. One, two, three, no. four, five, six. I think it's just bringing us closer together and trying to change the, the history here and just make more history, be more legendary, and just get this thing back to where it was a long time ago. All right, you can be honest, man. Were you nervous? I was a little nervous, Vern. <laughs> a little nervous at the end there. I felt really good this morning when I woke up. But as we made it to the fourth uh, quadrant of the bracket, I, I was like, there's no way CBS and cameras out here to not to, to not let us in. Right. right. I was, uh, but it was a, a very uh, exciting moment to see your name come across. When you see that name, in fact, my camera was right on you. I mean, it looked like all the emotions came out. You just... You closed your eyes, you jumped, you raised your hand, and then you went over and hugged your assistants. Yeah, it was, it's uh, like I said, we were sitting there for yeah. about 30 minutes waiting to hear a name called, and, and really it was a, a relief, a moment of relief, mm -hmm. but the culmination of a lot of hard work by our student athletes and our coaching staff to get to this point. And uh, I'm just grateful, man. I'm super grateful for our student athletes and everything they've done for us over the course of this year to put us in this spot. We made history today. What will your message be to the team? Are you going to do the old Normandale? Well, it's 94 feet. It's, <laughs> yeah, well, the well, basket's 10 feet high. It's the same dimensions at home. <laughs> Honestly, I, I want these guys to enjoy the moment. They've mm -hmm. accomplished something that's incredibly difficult to do, while at the same time, our goal is to win a couple games out there and see how long we can last in this tournament. And I think we have the type of kids and the type of student athletes that can do that. So uh, it's really it's back to work tomorrow and see if we can get better on Monday and Tuesday in practice before we get out of town. You're a son of the West Coast Conference. You played in it assistant coach yeah. you're a head coach how gratifying is all of this for you it's huge Vern. i mean for us to to make the tournament as an at-large team mm -hmm. right that hasn't been done by anybody outside of gonzaga st mary's and byu since 2002 mm -hmm. like you said i played in this league i know how hard it is to do what we just did mm -hmm. i'm super proud and uh like i said grateful for all the people in our program that made this possible it's not like you jump in the car and go home no you got work to do you you probably will walk out of here by midnight tonight. Well, huh? We got some film to watch, man. We, we got some games to break <laughs> right, down, and uh, right, right. we got to we got to learn about the racers a little bit. You know, they're top twenty-five team analytically, and so they'll give us some uh, some things to worry about tonight as we go to bed. But it's it's a good problem to have right now. What the heck is Tom Brady thinking? Announcing his comeback on your day? I'm telling what, you, what is he, that? Couldn't, he couldn't wait till tomorrow. I know. Come on, I, man. I know. <laughs> anyway, hey man, thanks so much for a few minutes. Hey, congratulations, you guys worked hard. Now you got to go out and get it. Thanks a lot, Vern. Appreciate you, man. <laughs>